It's an all new E Live, your weekend entertainment fix. Today, we take you inside the AC Marriott for the 12th production of the Jamaica Poetry Festival, JPF. Tons of creatives and supporters came out on the 14th of August to celebrate a day of poetry, art, and music. We caught up with event organizer and renowned poet Yasa Stafari to discuss the importance of the event. We want to promote writing and creating responsible, creative self expression. And we say, if you're not right, you're wrong. So we write to make things right. We write to rewrite history, burn illusions and fantasy, and create a new paradigm, a new faculty of interpretation, tell our own story, own our own destiny, empower and uplift our own people. The arts is a means of allowing people to excavate the latent and potent talents and ability to better express themselves in socially acceptable and socially responsible ways. So we want to nurture the poetry of life. And so every song is a poem set to music. So that shows you the role of poetry. And so we are just bringing everyone in the family of the creative, cultural, literary and performing arts under the banner of the poetry of life. Also in attendance was lecturer, author and visual artist, Dr. Clinton Hutton. No, poetry is very important, you know. And, and Jamaica has had a long history of, of poetry, going back into the 19th century and before that. And um, of course, we have produced great poets like Claude McKay, like Muta Baruka, like Yasu Safari. I mean, there are many great poets. And the, the, the poet of poets, Louis Bennett Coverley. I mean, we have another way of telling story. Stories will be via the visual arts. And um, I do photography and I do painting. I've been drawing from I was three years old. And, um, and therefore, this is, a, this is one of our area of artistic expressions. Um, I have done a number of works here. We have about what, six pieces. Um, I have two pieces called Don Cosmic. I did a series called Don Cosmic. This is one of them. In fact, this is the latest one. Somewhere done at the beginning, in fact, from the 1990s. Gone are the dark clouds that had me blind. It's gonna be a bright, 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 sunshiny day. Sudden escaping cloud, the sun came bright. And shimmering in guilt, he saw his own face peering from the pool. Toasting a muse. One man who came to dinner wouldn't eat just focused on his hostess' instant, eloquent devotion. He'd stand and say, as if proposing a toast, I speak this in your honor, ma'am, you are so beautiful. Well, that's where we end tonight's festivities in eLive, but there's so much more in store for entertainment, so be sure to catch us on the flip side tomorrow, same time, same place.